Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of my tutorial. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to animate a automatic clock in Autodex Maya 2020. So let's get started. First, go to create polygon primitives, take a polygon plane, scale the plane just like this. Now right click, assign new material, select Lambert, click on this color checker box, select file, locate your file, I put my file on desktop, click open, press 6 on your keyboard or just click on this icon to turn on the texture mode and see the effect, now select the Polygon plane, go to modify, freeze transformation. Rotate it 90 degree along X axis. Again go to modify, freeze transformation. Now rename it as a main clock, main clock. Turn off the grid. Now take a polygon cylinder. Scale the cylinder just like this. Now select the main clock. Hide it. Again select the polygon cylinder. Subdivision caps type 2. Now go to modeling toolkit, face selection mode, select the lower face, press delete, select this face, press delete. Now go to a selection mode, select this edge, shift select this edge. Click extrude or press Ctrl plus E to extrude. Move it just like this. A scale. Sorry. Ctrl plus Z to undo. Select this edge. Shift select this edge. Extrude. Press D or insert key on your keyboard and edit the pivot point and axis. Press D. Scale it to make it just like this. Now again click extrude. Move. Again click extrude, move, go to vertex mode, select this vertex, scale to make just like this, go to object mode, unhide the main clock, turn on wireframe on shaded mode, select the polygon cylinder, Rotate it 90 degree along X axis. Go to side view. Modify center pivot. Move it back just here. Wireframe on shaded mode. Go to Front view, texture mode,
turn off the grip put it at the center of this black icon press d or insert key press v to snap in the middle of this circle rotate it to position just like this now go to modify freeze transformation now go to vertex mode select this vertex scale and move just like this object mode go to perspective view press control plus d to duplicate and rename it as second handle hide it select this vertex mode object mode rename it as our handle press enter press control plus d to duplicate and hide the our handle and rename it as minute handle vertex mode select this vertex and scale a slightly bit select this vertex shift select this vertex and scale to make just like this go to object mode now unhide all the handle minute handle press enter open channel box select it and rotate this is rotating along z axis or z axis control g to undo select all go to modify freeze transformation now select the main clock press control plus g to group it and shift plus p to ungroup the main clock and select the our handle and parent it to the group 1 rename the group as timer then minute handle parent it to the timer and second handle and lastly the main clock now select the our handle as it is rotating along z axis see z axis control plus g to undo select the our handle control click on this 
rotate g axis right click open expression editor or go to windows animation editor expression editor now select this and copy control plus c and control plus v to paste it press space bar equal to and type this expression for our handle control plus v to paste it click create now select the minute handle select rotate g control plus c copy control plus v paste it space bar equal to and type this expression for the minute handle i give a link in the description box to this script now select the second handle rotate g copy the text space bar and copy this text for the second handle control plus v to paste it click create now again click and open frame rate select 24 frame per second this is most necessary cancel now increase the frame to 5000 or 6000 press enter type 0 here and also here 0 press enter now move it here select the hour handle press right click assign new material select Lambert change the Lambert color to red minute handle right click assign new material select Lambert change Lambert color to blue second handle right click assign new material select Lambert change the Lambert color to just yellow now go to frame 1 click play right click on the time slider playback speed select real time go to frame 1 turn off wireframe on shaded mode click play and see the effect now go to side view select this move it here click play and see the effect this is how you can create a automatic clock in autodex maya 2020 thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe my channel